Hello everybody and welcome to yet another episode of my Man series. This is episode number 127, I believe. Before we get into this episode, I would like to say thank you so much for spending some time with me here today. I really, really do appreciate your time. Without further ado, let's get right into this one. I hope you enjoy. So GM, I just woke up, it is the 19th, and I am waiting for the, well, I'm just about to go live, and then the Woodcutters Grove update should go live in like, probably an hour, hour and a half, so that is very exciting, we'll see what that brings, should bring, bring us some very exciting new content into the game, and we'll play through that in this video and see what's up with it. Our only real goal with this update is to get the tier 3 of the new new building built right away when it launches and then try and get the see how long it takes us to get the new imkando hatchet first login is the world still there okay you no longer qualified yes all right so let's finish making these frames we need four more mahogany frames and then we get to building already got the first last wills for the new death event or new die event hopefully i'll have Similar luck that I had with Aurora Dice with this one. Let's get our daily boxes. Where is it? Oh, there he is. So parcel info. <gasps> Imagine getting that. So die. Daily box. Let's get a die right away. Medium. Oh, it's only 100 per one parcel. That's actually kind of easy. <laughs> Dagonath bones and baby dragon bones. Hmm. Gotta speak to this this guy. Oh, his name is Oak. All right, so first we built this eastern border wall. That is the first one. Yay! Unlock all the music tracks. All right, here it is. Yay! We built the wall. See what's next. Alright, spoke to Bill, and now we can make the Grove Cabin Tier 1. Right, we are now building the first tier of the cabin. Whoa, that's a house. Tier 1 cabin is built. Yeah, I can now build the eastern side gate. Nice. Yes, bro, we have a side gate. Let's hope we can build the Tier 2 now. Tier 2 blue, 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 blue. Oh my, uh, blueprints, done. Yes. Now we go build, and now we can use the side gate that we just built. Wow, why did my... Okay, and go in here. Bang, bang, tier two. Oh my god, we got a new fireplace in there. Oh, golly goodness. Oh, we also got a fairy ring and a tree patch. And the last one, Grove Cabin tier three. There we go. This took forever. Yes, a fort of my own. We have the tier 3 again. And we have the tier 3 on the new building. Give him a trim back. Wait, what did you say? What? With the latest expansion, even the elder tree has recovered. Oh my. After upgrading the grove, return to oak. Yes. And we got one of the new bird's nests. They give you the... Imkando hatchet fragments. Now, it's probably three more. Let's have a quick look at these. At tier one, you will gain access to normal and oak trees in the grove. Birds has found whilst wood cutting will be automatically placed in your backpack. And you will gain the ability to store wood spirits in the wood box. Tier two, you will gain access to willow trees, yew trees, choking ivy, and a fairing in the grove. Access to a new tree farming patch, and you will gain the ability to store bird's nests in the wood box. Tier 3, you will gain access to an elder tree. The ability to obtain bird's nests containing imkando hatchet pieces. Additionally, newly up obtained bird's nests have improved contents. Now we get to chopping. Let's make the first one. Wood box. Cool. And we have one of the finest elder wood boxes. Oh yeah. Oh yo 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 what's that in my wood box? 
What's that in my wood box? That's an incandor piece. Yes, bro. Unless I'm seeing seeing things. That might be a wood 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 piece. Incando piece fragment thing. Let's count the let's count the nests that we got. Or two pieces. So we have two pieces now. We have eight. Fifteen. Twenty-six. Thirty-six. Thirty-seven. Ooh, what is this I see? Is that another piece? Please tell me that it's three out of four because I have a ridiculous amount of these bird's nests now. Let's see how many of these nests we have. Is that one? Should be, should be one of the pieces. Yeah, hatchet fragment three. We are only missing one now. I really wanted to get this video out on the first day of this release, but it's looking a bit unlikely. So the second fragment took me 37 bird's nests and we now have 125 in here. So that took a hot while for that. Also was a bit of a bummer is when this update went live, the tree shaking scrimshaw was somehow very overtuned. As you can see from the picture on the screen, it is now been hot fixed. So at release that thing was spawning implings every 30 seconds or so. I got a lot of pirate implings from that. But that is no longer the case. And now since the tree shaking scrimshaw, why people use it is because of the 400% buff to bird's nests. Now that they nerfed the spawn of the spawn rate of the implings, people are kind of thinking that maybe the bird's nest rates were also nerfed by this. So if that is the case, that is really unfortunate because that means that the people who finished this axe early, who were on this right away after the update, had a definitely a huge head start to the others. Oh my god, that is pretty lucky. I think what I'm seeing right now in my bird's nest is the last piece of the hatchet. Please tell me that is the case. Empty. Yes. Yes, bro. Fragment number four. Last piece was at 125 and that was at 145. So that was, that was pretty lucky. I started with this scrim shopping at 20 hours. And now it is at 11 hours, 50 minutes. So quickly running up the maths, that is roughly eight hours of wood cutting we did for this new hatchet. I'm going to finish making the hatchet tomorrow, but I quickly wanted to look at some numbers. So for the most part, we were chopping elder logs today. And I checked my wad today. Before the update, I had like 3,200 elder logs. And now we have 5,369, which by the way, is not intentional. That is extremely funny. But in eight hours chopping over 2,000 elder logs, I think that's pretty good. I think the rates were significantly increased for the, for the amount of logs you can chop per hour. That is... Pretty decent if you was to if I was to make these into the like the death spore arrow arrow shots And also you can see my rune pixels woodcutting XP gain for the day So that that was in eight hours, but that is Minus the mini evil tree that I do and divine locations So that is like minus 150k 170k ish from that so like 1.2 mil just from chopping elder elder trees that is pretty good. Not the greatest XP, but I'll take it. That was that was okay XP. And now, my friends, I will go lay on my back for roughly eight hours because I know I am unable to sleep because it is like 40 degrees in my room and I have no air conditioning. Good night. Let's see this new bird's nests. What kind of seeds do you get from these? I'm not impressed. Okay, I am very much not impressed. I thought you would get like golden dragon fruit seeds or something, but... Seems to just be high level tree seeds. A ting tingling in my imkando fingers. Is that? Yes, you've found part of the ancient imkando hatchet. May I take a look at it? Please do. <gasps> you have all four pieces with these. I can recreate an ancient imkando hatchet for you. It won't be easy though. As well as the pieces, I'll need a dragon hatchet and one million coins to buy other materials. And a red berry pie. All right, lad. I have all those things with me now. Yes, Thurgo, mate. Imkando hatchet. That looks kind of sick. So it has been augmented, and now we've got Hone 6. Burnish for, for Prosper in there. Wow, it looks small. <laughs> it looks pretty small. Compared to the Crystal hatchet, it does look pretty small. Doesn't it? Yeah. But it's sleek. It's cool. We have a new hatchet. It's tier eighty. We can chop wood a bit, a bit 
quicker now. And with that being said, I'll go try my brand spanking new Imkando hatchet on some golden bamboo here. Thank you so much for watching this video. A reminder, live almost every day at twitch.tv slash yakiRS. Would love to see you there. Hope you have a fantastic rest of the day. Until next time, Yaki out.